I use these all the time. They're even better than the first pair I had. So real, amazing. From America, I'd love to go there. Everything starts there. Everything we do, the music, the lifestyle. Even dad agrees. They were the ones who started the crops that he does now. And the animals. People used to have protests against GM things. Not anymore. Well, don't suppose there's a choice. They had to do it though. Mum said it started when she was my age. There were so many people starving, they had to use all the land. It must have been nice then. Vans used to travel round. You could see them live. Not now. You have to use these now. They do everything. With these, you can see how it was back then. Just wild places. Well, not wild, just nature, I suppose. It wasn't just all crops, crops, crops. There were forests and all sorts of animals living there. And people lived there too. Tiny little houses right out in the country. Or in villages. They look so cute. I'll tell you what isn't cute though. Famine. All those horrible pictures of children, animals with bones sticking out. Oh, it's awful. That's the poor countries. They can't afford all the high tech stuff we've got now, so they just have to, well, suffer. We're lucky compared with them. Oh, I'd still like to go back to those days. It must have been so quiet, I can't imagine it. Walking out of your house and just space there. No crowds, no noise, none of the crime and stuff you get now. Well, not as much. It's a bit like that when I go out to the farm with Dad on holidays. He's always busy, but I just wander around. I don't like looking in the sheds much though. Like animal cities they are. Thousands of birds all jammed together, hardly any feathers on them. No, I just walk around the edges of the fields. Silence is gorgeous. I thought of asking Dad if Joey could come one time. He's my boyfriend. Well, sort of. He thinks he is anyway. I don't think any of my friends at school have been out there. I tell them about it and they're just like, oh yeah, right. I don't think they believe me. Can't blame them, I suppose. So different from here. They don't even believe me when I tell them that's where their food comes from. I think they think chickens are born as chunks wrapped in plastic. I've used images from the farm to programme these for a school project. Took some of Mum's old photos too. I've made it so that it's what it must have been like when Grandad was the farmer. Cows and sheep in the fields, chickens running around the yard. It's funny to see it, but it looks great. I found a site with wildlife films too. I'm going to download them and programme them in as well. Deer, eagles, otters, badgers. They're amazing things to see. In fact, Joey said he'd found a new site. I think I'll call him and get him to transfer them now. He'll be online. He always is.